LastPass tutorial, how to use LastPass password manager step by step. Hi guys, welcome to the channel and today I will show you a step-by-step -step tutorial on how to use LastPass password manager to secure all your online account passwords. LastPass is a secure password manager that stores all of your usernames and passwords in one safe place called a vault. Your vault is your central hub of all stored data. After you save a password to your vault, LastPass will always remember it for you. LastPass can be used in any devices and it's super secure and perfect for everyone for personal or business use. You can start with a free account. They have free plan here that includes unlimited passwords so you can save all your online account passwords here. But you can only access it in one device, computer or mobile. And you can have autofill password also included in the free plan. And you can share your vault or passwords with one person. And if you want more, you can upgrade to premium plan for $3 per month and the family's plan for $4 per month. And you also have plans for business. So for business plan, it starts $4 per month and they also have $6 per month. So here we can start with a free plan. So to get started here, first we need to create our account. So let me click on Get LastPass Free here. Here to create an account, you just need to provide your email and create a master password. So from all your password online, this master password here in your LastPass is what you just need to remember the most. And the rest you can just let LastPass software remember it for you. So make sure you create a secure master password and always remember this one password here. And once you are done, just click on sign up, it's free. And then you'll be prompted to this page. This is the next step where you can download the app extension of LastPass to your browser or to your mobile device. So let me just download it to my browser and wait for the download to finish. It may take a little time. And once done, you'll see here your LastPass icon. And this is now your main dashboard. And over here, the next step that we need to do is to add our password. So everything that you added here or the password that you added here, there is no need for you to remember this password because this LastPass software will always remember it for you. So again, the only password that you need to remember is your LastPass master password. That's it. So here you have different ways to add your online password here in your LastPass vault. The first one is from your dashboard. Go to add icon and select password and just provide a URL link. For example, facebook.com, pinterest.ph, instagram.com, something like that. Then name this password like for Facebook, Facebook or Pinterest. Then add your username and then enter your password here. And you can also, from advanced settings, you can allow the auto login or disable the auto fill out of your password. Or you can also allow require master password reprompt when you log in to your online account. You can just skip this if you want to. Me, I will just skip this. And once done, just hit save. Then your password will be added here. The second one is when you log in to your online account, for example, I will go to Pinterest.ph and I will go ahead and log into my Pinterest account. So when I log in, there will be a pop-up box showing up here to add the password and username from these social media. So just click on add to add it in your last pass vault. And once you added the password successfully, the next time that you log in, you'll see that the LastPass icon here, it will auto fill out the login for you to make it easier for you to log into your online account. So this software is really great, especially for those people hiring freelancer to manage their social media accounts. With this app, you can just invite a freelance to use LastPass for free. And then you can share your vote to this freelance so that he can log into your account without giving the real password from his own computer. 
So with LastPass Vault, it will auto fill out the login information and you can secure your password from other person or user. They will not able to see your password, but if you will allow them to see your password, then you can also change the settings in your LastPass account. But that is not advisable. To secure your password, you should be the only one knows your password. LastPass is not just to secure your online password, but also you can use this to make your online payment or online shop more easier and secure. So here from your left sidebar, go to Payment Cards and click the Add icon to add your bank card information. You can add as many cards as you want. Then also you can go to your address and here you can add your address like your home address, shipping address, business address so that when you visit a site and ask for your payments and address, you can simply click the last pass icon up here and then this app will auto fill out the form for your payment method and for your address. Also, you can make use of the LastPass to secure and organize some confidential documents. So to do that, just go to your notes and add notes. And here you can name your notes and enter the details. And then you can also attach file here. Now, there are many things you can keep here in your LastPass vault for security. So let's go to all items and click add here and click more items and here you'll see you can also secure your driving license information here your passport social security number insurance policy health insurance membership and even your wi-fi password and more so going to your settings here you can also add multi-factor authentication to add security in your LastPass account so here you have different options to add multi-factor authentication. So you have your Google Authenticator, uh, Microsoft Authenticator, and more. So you just need to select here. You also have your fingerprint and smart card. And also you can add some trusted devices so that when there is an activity in a different device that not added here, then you will be receiving an alert for you to change your password right away to avoid any hackers. So you can also add some mobile device here and more. By the way, to share your password or login information, just go to your all items and here you can click this person's icon and then just enter the email of the person that you want to share your login. And the other person need to create an account in LastPass as well to make use of your vault. And here you can allow to show the password or not to the other person. So LastPass is a really great tool to use to secure your password and to share your password to other people or to freelance who you want to manage your social media account. This software is really perfect for you. So I guess that's all for today's video and I hope that you like this video. If you have any question guys, don't hesitate to comment down below and thank you so much for watching.